In this tutorial, we're going to generate a dimension in a two-dimensional image. To do this, we'll use a color corrector. This effect will create a displacement map by means of different shapes that work within correction vectors. First, we rotoscope the whole shape of our character. Once this first shape is completed, we replace the image with a solid black one, and we add a Comp 3D effect, which we specify as the first input to the image, and as the second input to the color corrector with the solid shape. In the Comp 3D effect, we set the background parameter to No, and set the ambient light as white, by selecting the Ambient folder, and choosing White in the Set Color tab. In layer 1, we activate Displacement Map and set the polygonal subdivision as 5. We set the Displacement Map 0 parameter to 0 and the width of the map to 50. We edit the camera position, orbiting around the layer a little to better view the displacement. Now we go back to the color corrector and increase the value of the shadow of Vector 1. This way, we can interactively define the amount of displacement allocated to the complete figure of the character. If we locate the camera frontal again, we can gently orbit around the layer and we notice the feeling of three-dimensionality in the picture. To make this effect more complex, we add more relief by adding a new vector and creating shapes to enhance the sensation of relief in the figure of the character, highlighting his arm, chest, forehead and face and other details that we want to bring forward. With this vector, we also increase the value of shadows, increasing the displacement value of this new shape cumulatively to the previous shape. Orbiting the camera now, we have a more successful sense of three-dimensionality, and we can distinguish relief in the character. We can add more shapes and add detail in the generated relief. If we view the color corrector, we can see the displacement map we are creating. 